crowd. I'm Rodney Danger playing the field. I'm an old school stand-up comic and I just opened up my marriage because I fucking hate my wife. <laughs> take my wife, please. Please, take my wife and drown her somewhere. <laughs> I take my wife everywhere, but she always finds her way home. I would love for one of you to drown my wife. <laughs> What are you gonna do? I got a girlfriend, okay? I, got, I opened up the marriage, I got a girlfriend. We're at dinner last week, I said, babe, I think we should go home and have super sex. She said, I'll take the soup. I said, you remind me of my wife. I said, uh, all of a sudden, I'm imagining I wanna just pour that soup straight into my girlfriend's lungs. <laughs> girlfriend I want to drown her too. Yeah, most guys they open up their marriage, they double their chance of getting laid. Me, I double my chance of life in prison. Oy vey. <laughs> but it wasn't always like this. My wife and I, we were happy for 20 years. Then we met. <laughs> and my girlfriend, we have an on again, off again relationship. I get on, she tells me to get off. I don't know why I opened up this marriage, why I played the field. I get no respect, no respect. But I'm working on it. I'm trying to do nice things for my wife, right? I signed her up for a bridge club, paid for it and everything. They're supposed to jump off the bridge next week. <laughs> now, if that doesn't work, I will pay one of you a million dollars to permanently sink my wife. <laughs> and I'm still working on things with the girlfriend. We have an anniversary coming up. I said, babe, hey, what do you want to do for the anniversary? She said, I want to go somewhere I've never been before. I said, hey, try the Mariana Trench. <laughs> and don't forget your wedding, your uh, anniversary present. It's this beautifully wrapped cinder block. It's a cinder block. Now, some people will say, hey, Rodney, why don't you just break up with your girlfriend and divorce your wife? Well, a couple things. It's not permanent enough. And I happen to be a little bit religious. 